Yo, we're gonna get into the science about full moons and rituals. And basically, this energy that's inside of you, which also be, be is being used against you, where you can use it to manifest things, especially on full moons. All right, check this out. Full moon is you, your spirit, your soul, your subconsciousness. Sun is basically your consciousness aware of being you, yourself, your physical. Consciously, things of you of, that you're aware of. So basically, with this being said, we're going to get into the Aries rituals on the full moon, <clears throat> how this can affect you and what you can do. Aries is ruled by Mars. So this way, you know, put all your intent and all your anger inside of what you want to get accomplished. But there's people, places, and things, your jobs, situations, people that's aggering you, annoying you, for me, if you want to cast a spell ritual on them, basically, like, get them <clears throat> out of your circumstances and, like, isolate them from you, <clears throat> you got to put all your intent and your willpower in it. Also, you got to, like, picture it, picture it happening and put all your energy and your force into it. Get a paper and pen, write it down on paper and repeat it to yourself and take advantage of these energies because you know every now and then it's like the moon survives for nine months and the sun survives for 12 months so it's like a correlation it's like basically and remember the moon ain't gonna be here forever so you got to take advantage of these opportunities and energies i mean you can manifest good rituals and you can manifest bad rituals there's no there's no good and bad but for me on by your, by any means necessary. If you really have to use this energy, you can use it. But if you don't have to use it, then, but at the end of the day, everybody should be taking care and utilizing these energies so they can manifest good things and prosperity in their journey, which down the road will help them. <clears throat> I'm not saying pray to the moon or get on your knees. I'm saying write down the words, I'm well, utilize such and such, et cetera, et cetera. Make sure you write this shit down. Make sure you use you utilizing the words me, I'm. You don't wanna really write I, cause you don't know what I is. I is like an entity. You just adding energy towards that person. Write I'm, and write I'm going to be successful. I'm going to be dominant. I'm going to be consistent. I'm going to manifest. That's how you do it. And once this is situated, you know, Read over the paper. You don't have to put blood on the paper. You don't got to do that shit. Cause you feel me? You need your blood to survive. You need your blood to manifest shit. But if you want to put blood on the paper, that's true for me. That's true. But I'm saying, like, when you do this shit, <coughs> when you finish, <coughs> bring the paper. Cause remember, the full moon is Sunday, Sunday night. So when you do this shit, just meditate with the paper. Give it some time. You can picture it in your mind or you can clear your mind, it's up to you, for me. Take some deep breaths, look up towards your forehead, <sighs> inhale, exhale, and you know, utilize the energies that we are taking. Because remember, the Galactic Federation of Light, the Illuminati, the, Muff, the Freemasons, they're using this energy against you every day. So when you say, oh, that's witchcraft, or listen, they ain't got shit to do with nothing. This English language shit that you're speaking out your mouth is witchcraft. It's demonic. It's Babylon. It casts spells. It's backwards. That's what we're doing. We're living backwards, and we got to reverse that shit. So all that extra shit that y'all talking about, oh, it's witchcraft, cut that shit the fuck out, all right? You know witchcraft, none of that shit. For me, everything is witchcraft. Then. Everything is wizards, witches, warlords, warlocks, ma masons, masons. <laughs> It's, it's, it's all that shit, man. You do it with your words. <clears throat> you do it by eating meat, rituals and shit. All that shit, feel me? And nah, don't eat meat, man. You don't want that energy or DNA picked up in you, feel me? That's basically can reincarnate your ass. It's just something low. So it's very important to make sure utilizing things and utilizing this energy and ascending and not just sitting back and getting spells casted on you and you wonder why you wake up in a when you get up in the morning, well, not the morning, when you get up in the rising, you feel tired, you feel lazy, you feel sleepy and shit. <laughs> you got to be strong physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. You got to compete, com 
complete this process every single day, <clears throat> manifest everything every single day, talk it into existence, existence every single day, no days off. Because them demonic entities, them dark forces, they don't take days off when they're trying to get their energies and powers from you. The motherfuckers don't sleep. You, when you activate this shit properly and find time for yourself, knowing that's already activated and put all that intent and willpower in, you'll be real realize and understand and understand that, oh shit, sleep is an illusion. You don't really need sleep. Sleep is what causes things to not get done. Feel me? That's pretty much it about this video. We're gonna wrap it up real quick, but yo, take advantage of these energies and shit and manifestations. Feel focused.